I cannot take it any longer. I have to hear this song. So after doing the Dolly Parton Thanksgiving Cowboys game performance, everybody was like, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, uh, listen to some more Dolly. And I said, all right, bet. And I said, I got to hear the rest of that Jolene song. Because, again, my family was singing it. Um, I saw a lot of people on the Internet saying how much they love that song and everything. So I'm like, OK. And again, I feel like we heard most of the song because seeing that is only a two minute something song. Clearly, this is like what I, what I what I heard on Thanksgiving Day was probably most of the song. He, she was basically begging Jolene not to take her man. She loved this man, wanted to be with this man. But clearly, Jolene had a had a had a hold on her man and Jolene was about to take him. That's pretty much the, the summary, but I, I want to hear the whole thing. And then I want to find out if this is a true story because I know Dolly wrote a lot of her music. So I want to know if this is a true story based on a real thing. So I'm ready to hear this and experience this. We are back on our Dolly Parton journey. It's been so long. It's been months. I feel like it's almost been a year. So... We're back. We're ready. Let's go. Jolene, 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 Jolene. I'm begging of you, please don't take my man. Jolene, 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 Jolene. Just because you can Your beauty is beyond compare With flaming locks of auburn hair With ivory skin and eyes of emerald green Your smile is like a breath of spring Your voice is soft like summer rain And I cannot compete with you, Jolene Talks about you in his sleep And there's nothing I can do to keep from crying When he calls your name Jolene And I can easily understand How you could easily take my man But you don't know what he means to me Jolene Jolene, 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 Jolene I'm begging of you please don't take my Just you can. I love the backing vocals. Yo, I gotta, we gotta find out who Jolene is. Because, yo, that's crazy. And I'm looking at Dolly Parton on this, I presume, album cover. Because it says featuring I Will Always Love You. So, maybe, I don't know, but, I mean... Dolly Parton, beautiful woman. Beautiful woman. Um, so I got to see what Jolene look like. Like, I mean, she's begging this woman. Because, like, this man, this man got Dolly, right? Got a beautiful woman. Jolene must have been, like, the Marilyn Monroe of the time. Like, I gotta see who this was. Because she's sitting here begging this woman not to take her man. But the beauty, but like the music as a whole, the instrumentation, I didn't notice, maybe I just subconsciously didn't pay no attention. The violins. That was a beautiful touch. And now we got the backing vocals harmonizing the Jolene. And I just love, I, again, it has a folk rock feel to it. Kind of that country twang to it with that, with that guitar. So, but yeah, this is, I, I, I understand why my family like this. Like, this is fire. Please don't take him just because you can. Joy 
choice of men But I could never love again He's the only one for me, Jolene I had to have this talk with you My happiness depends on you And whatever you decide to do, Jolene Fire. Fire. We got to find out, though. Hold on. We about to find out right now. Who the hell was Jolene? Who was Jolene that... I'm sorry. I just read something. Kind of messed me up. Um, We got to find out who was Jolene... To have Dolly Parton begging for her not to take her man. We got to find, we got to find Jolene. I, I'm going to just click. According to Parton, the song was inspired by a redheaded bank clerk who flirted with her husband, Carl Dean, at his local bank branch around the time they were newly married. In an interview... She also revealed that Jolene's name and appearance are based on that of a young fan who came on stage for her autograph. Hmm. Okay, gotcha. So, name and likeness was of a fan, but the inspiration came from a bank clerk. Gotcha. Uh, produced by Bob Ferguson, recorded at RCA Studio B in Nashville, Tennessee, May 22nd, 1973, released October 15th, 1973, by RCA Victor, album of the same name, gotcha. They labeled it as country, okay, yeah, I, I, I would agree with that. It's currently ranked on the 2021 500 Greatest Songs of All Time by Rolling Stone at number 63. Uh, it is her most covered song, according to Pardon. Chip Young on uh, guitar. She wrote Jolene on the same day that she wrote I Will All... Oh, she was on a roll. <laughs> she was just feeling it that day. Oh, wow. That's incredible. That's incredible. Um... On stage in 1988, Parton told the audience that Jolene was a true story and the reason she did not like to sing it too often. Wow. That's incredible. Olivia Newton-John, PTX, The White Stripes, whole. Oh. All these people made covers to this song? Of course, Miley Cyrus. Lil Nas X. <laughs> wow, PTX, White Stripes, and Olivia Newton John. I've yet to start my Olivia Newton John journey, but I'm I'm ready to start it soon. Three times platinum in the U.S., two times platinum in the U.K. Just platinum, platinum, platinum everywhere, all over the world. Not surprised, man. Again, my family when when we were watching the game. And Dolly Parton came on to uh, to to perform. Um, 
Yeah, like my family was singing it. I was like, wow. Like everybody know this song but me. So, oh look, and here, here's 9 to 5. I want to hear the rest of 9 to 5. That was also a song she performed on the Thanksgiving show. So I, I, I got a lot of catching up on Dolly Parton to do. Got a lot of catching up to do. So I'm, I'm definitely going to continue this journey and listen to more Dolly Parton ASAP because, um, well, for one, she's a legend. And I feel bad. Again, I did that one uh, reaction and... It was so much fun. I don't know what made me stop, but either way, we definitely going to get back into Dolly Parton and her musical uh, discography. So y'all let me know what else from, from Dolly I need to check out. I, I really want to check out this nine to five, but I, I'll stick in the order that y'all tell me to. So y'all let me know. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time with Dolly Parton, peace.